bought a box of condoms in 2012 Now it's 2016 and I'm using them on myself No, I haven't gotten laid in a long time No, I haven't gotten laid in a long time It's not cause my heart's broken, it's not cause I'm lame But if you're not fucked, you're fucked, so it's all the same I wish I could tell you that I don't own a personal device I wish I could tell you that I've never used it more than twice I wish I could tell you that I don't jerk off every day I wish I could tell you that it really made a difference either way Cause it's the same since 2012 Guess you could say I'm a little too hard on myself No, I haven't gotten laid in a long time No, I haven't gotten laid in a long time It's not that I'm tired of playing the game But if you're not fucked, then you're fucked So it's all the same I mean, if it wasn't for sex, there would be no humanity but if it wasn't for humanity, maybe you would want to have sex with me Cause I haven't gotten laid in a long time No, I haven't gotten laid in a long time It's not like I deserve to, it's not like I don't But if I get fucked, I'll be fucked, so I guess I won't Pornography has made me respect people Cause I see genitals so much in my free time I don't even give a shit about genitals in real life I'd rather get to know what kind of person someone is Their hopes and dreams, likes and dislikes, all that rainbow shit Having actual relationships with people only made me physically lust for more But now that enough time has passed, I've forgotten what it's like to be intimate So much so that I don't miss it I simply milk myself daily like a dairy cow You know, just so my udders don't burst Am I celibate by choice or circumstance? Either way, I'm fucking sick of fucking and romance delicious looking and they make you spend your money before they let you take them home and then when you think you're in for the ride of your lifetime you get a good taste of what's going on and it's freaking awful so then you have to make a decision do you put up with a bad taste in your mouth and torture yourself for months on end just because you're thirsty or do you throw it out because it isn't good enough for you wasting all the time and money you spent on it leaving yourself thirsty again. Maybe I'll just act like a dick to the orange juice. It'll get sick of me and throw me out so I don't have to throw it out. But even if you do get rid of it, how confident do you feel about going back and finding another one? Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice, more shame on me. Maybe I should just switch to another drink. But you know in your heart of hearts that you've only ever had that special attraction to orange juice wildest dream is to enjoy the perfect orange juice but you know you're lying to yourself when you pretend like that perfect orange juice actually exists you know that it's either be thirsty yet content or orally satisfied yet miserable but what about all these people out there they seem to be so happy with their orange juice well maybe for them they'll tell you it's not about themselves it's about the drink you love well fuck that I'm not gonna trick myself into thinking that something tastes good when it doesn't. If it sucks, it sucks. I'd rather be thirsty than deal with someone else's problems all the time. Besides, who needs a drink when you've got plenty of liquid in your mouth already? <laughs> okay, I think I've had enough of this extended metaphor.
End the song. End the song already. Thank you.